All right, everybody. So the third 12262 just came in. Um, this one is going to be really short, this review, because obviously I reviewed it two other times. Um, so yeah, so obviously you guys should know what it's like. And it's basically the older version, the older brother of the 521, so... Yeah, but anyways, here it is, in all its glory. And there's the straw I was talking about. It's covering up the antenna. So, um, yeah. So, yeah, that's what it looks like. Blue backlight, you know, yada yada. Um, there's the warning watch and advisor, and you can actually see the things, kind of. It's a little, it's hardly noticeable. I can definitely notice it right here. So, um, yeah, but anyways... That's what it looks like. Saturday, mostly cloudy. Cold with highs in the lower 30s. Northwest winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. And now the extended forecast for the radio listening Oops. area. Saturday night, mostly cloudy. Cold with lows around 20. West winds around 5 miles per hour. Becoming south around 5 miles per hour after midnight. Sunday, cloudy. As you can clearly hear, the reception is absolutely beautiful. So, um, yeah. So that's a good sign. Um, and honestly, I think with the... I think, um, considering that this is an 06 model, um, it's obviously gonna be the oldest model. So, I believe the 262 is gonna, you know, for activating, it's gonna be just like the WR300. So, yeah, I believe so. Um, so, yeah, so I'm hoping that with this reception, it's going to activate for the RWT next week. Well, I'm honestly not going to. Well, well, actually, I actually am going to tell because next week I'm not going to have any school on Wednesday next week. Um, now, the reason is, is because it's going to be basically throughout most of next week is going to be exams, you know, for scheduled. Um, and I'm not going to have any on Wednesday, so that's a good sign. That's a great sign. The only day I'm really going to have them is Thursday. So, yeah, so that is great. So I'm going to be able to get an RWT for January at least. So, yeah. Really wishing you good luck. Oh, yeah, that's right. I didn't do the whole pressing all the buttons. Um, producing a wind chill 41 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And now the hourly information. For I can't the believe it's getting WWF 48. Light accumulations of a light wave. And it's getting WWF 72, too. But anyways, um, and then the up and down arrows are the volume, the siren volume. I guess I'll do a little test real quick. There you go. So yeah, um, everything is on, so it's good. Okay, so yeah, so this is really basically about it. There's not much else to say about it. So um, yeah, but anyways. Yeah, really looking forward to getting the RWT next week. I'm so glad because this is literally going to be the only RWT I'm going to be getting for this month. So, um, yeah. Wait, what the heck am I doing? Wait, time. Honestly, I was just fixing the time because it was it was a couple minutes behind. I would usually prefer only up one minute behind because look, it says four forty three on here and then four forty four. Honestly, two minutes behind, I just don't really like that much. That's why I was fiddling a little bit with WR one hundred. All right, um, I'm gonna end the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it.
even though it was nothing special, it was just me reviewing the 262, which I'm hoping is not going to have the same issues with activating as Charlotte EAS's old 262 as well. <sighs> Please don't let me down. Please don't let me down. So yeah, I'm going to go.